And so I really appreciate it. All right. So I appreciate every single one of you. We get more people logging in right now. So we are just going to give another few minutes for people to finish logging in and um, and then we'll get started. But really good news, man. Really, really good news. I'm so proud of every single person who is on this line. You know, um, this is a team effort, team sport, and it's something that we can't do by ourselves. And I'll tell you what, for all the ambassadors, so there's going to be a couple different things happening, but for all the ambassadors and angels, um, you know, we're going to create, we're going to create an ambassador and angel council. And uh, as we move forward, um, you know, you guys are going to be people that are helping us to shape and form and, and, you know, create what we do moving forward within, within humanity and how we, how we, you know, the ideas and how we, how we put everything together. Cause you know, you're the people that put the work in the ambassadors, uh, the angels, and there's going to be another leadership pool. So everyone that's, that's in, in these spaces, um, and, you know, for, for the people that as well that, um, you know, for whatever reason, you might have been financially unable to do so. I know some of you guys have been praying for us and everything like that. You know, you guys are also uh, also in the same family, right? You guys are also in the same family. So we appreciate everyone. Miss Ari, thank you for taking care of your family out there. This is really a family sport and you, you've you been playing well. Captain and uh, helping helping uh, Mr. Bandy, Clarence, the captain, the uh, Bandy and Ola family. Right. So you guys did really well as well. So. Thanks everyone for logging in this morning um, or on, on my side is morning is uh, 7.55 in the morning. Well, actually no, so 8.07 in the morning. Um, I know for a lot, a lot of people uh, in the US, most people are on the uh, PM side, the evening side of the day. So thank you all anyways for logging in wherever time you are, wherever you are in the world. All right, see what else is in here. People are still logging in. So we're gonna start in exactly three minutes. It'll be nice right on top of the head or even before that, if uh, it looks like we get to go. So um, let your people know to, to when they log in to add their microphone so they can hear is one of the people that, that are logged in, but they, their microphones are not added. So if you got somebody on your team, you know, all the team leaders, if, and if you, if, even if you have only one person, you're a team leader, because <laughs> it's a team of two, all right? You and that person. So make sure you take care of everyone in your team. Uh, this is how we keep everything close, make sure everybody gets taken care of. Uh, in addition, uh, this is just a little bit of housekeeping while we wait for the login. In addition, uh, please make sure that you are um, adding everyone into your into the uh, HNFT and uh, ASL issuance group, right? There's probably still a little bit of ASL out there that we're going to issue right after we finish getting this done. Um, issuing the uh, it's one or two matches people mentioned to me that, that we got to take care of. But, you know, again, when we keep it tight and close as a team, you know, we'll take care of everyone on the front end so we don't have to double back and do stuff at this this makes it a lot of additional work, you know, people to do so that we don't, that we don't necessarily do so um, that we don't necessarily need to do. Right. So please keep your whole team close, you know, keep your family close and your team closer. How about that? <laughs> All right. So I think we can go ahead and get started again. Welcome every single one for being here this morning. Um, you know, some are really, really good news. And by the way, um, you know, everyone here, I mean, we've got different personalities and everything like that. So again, a little bit of housekeeping. Um, I had one or two people mention, I know a lot of people here are Christians, but um, so, you know, it's okay with most people, but um, some people are different faiths. And so, um, you know, if you, if you post things that are motivational or uh, inspirational, it's fine. Um, but some people, you know, a little bit uncomfortable if, you know, if you get too, too, too into the, into the faith, you know, you know, pictures of Christ and stuff like that. I got some, some feedback from those. So, you know, obviously, um, most people are okay with, you know, with getting some prayers and stuff like that. But, you know, just keep, uh, just try to keep it as, as, you know, keep it in your circles when you, when you want to, when you want to go hard with the prayer and stuff like that. And then, you know, motivational things, stuff like that is okay. But we just want to keep it uh, open for everyone because we, all of us are family. And so, you know, just, you know, we just want to keep it, keep it as, as uh, friendly as possible for everyone. Right. And so no one was really offended, but some people, again, have different faiths. And so I always try to keep, especially for our, our main humanity boards, you know, um, you know, if you got your personal groups and your team and, and you know, you got prayer warriors and stuff in your team, you know, pray on in those prayer, in those, in those individual groups where, where everyone is aware of who's in that group. Um, let me go ahead and mute everyone again. All right. Just go ahead and do that in your, in your personal groups. But for the main pages, um, you know, again, you know, we have different faiths. We have, you know, people from Jewish community, people from the Muslim community, people from, whatever, whatever faiths they are. And so we want to be as, you know, we want to be as respectful for everyone in their communities and um, as possible. 
Um, so that's just a little bit of housekeeping. Also, our main pages. Um, if you have your opinions, you you're more than welcome to you're more than welcome to share your opinions. But again, you know, be respectful of not just yourself, but be respectful of everybody else's teams because a lot of people work really hard to a lot of people are, are really uh, work really hard um, to you know have people come join or you know or, or team and understand what's going on. And so you know if you have negative challenges, you know bring that to your upline directly or bring it to me directly. You know, um, you know, don't whatever kind of negative things you got, whatever doubts you have, you know, the humanity leadership page is not is not a place to do that. And I'm really, really uh, I, I believe I'm pretty um, patient and, and tolerant. But if but if you post, I mean, if you post things consistently, you know, I'm going to remove you from the group. And that's 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 that. Right. Um, because, again, we have to protect the entire team. And so your personal issues, your personal concerns and not to be vented in our main pages. That's not the place for it because it, it, it's not good for everyone else that's bringing their team and putting the work in is not fair to them, all right? So that's a little bit of housekeeping, um, but really good and really exciting news. And and, um, and by the way, just, just FYI as well, if you got your camera open, just be aware that everyone can see whatever you got going on, you know, in your home or, uh, you know, um, <laughs> a fortunate one. Somebody brought to my attention one of our videos from way, way back. Somebody forgot their camera was on and, you know, they were, they were going to take a shower. <laughs> I, I didn't even see it until somebody told me about it, right? So just be aware that if your camera is open, whatever, you know, whatever is in your house, people can see, okay? All right. And so with that being said, let's go ahead and get a call started. Thank you for everyone that's logged in this morning again. I'm just really excited that, um, you know, that we have officially, 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 I'm gonna let everybody just just um just you know unmute for one second and and say congratulations for all the hard work. But we have officially hit our number to uh, pay our license off, so now we are all official license owners. So just go ahead and congratulate yourselves for that. Because that's the big one. Congratulations! Let it go! Congratulations! Great, great, great! Thank you. That's great, great, yeah. man. That's great. That's great. Powerful. So. Again, this is a, all a team effort, you know, um, you know, and Mark is really excited about the whole, the whole, whole team pulling together. You know, we talked about getting it first. And so we understand that, like, you know, this whole team pulled together. There's a lot of people that didn't, that didn't pull together with this, but we, we, we pulled this together. So as a result, um, I'm gonna let him go ahead and, 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 and uh, bring, bring up one or two things. But what we did is that we knew that there was a lot of people that, people had banking issues you know i got people in the caribbean that had banking issues banks were closed and this and this and that um also uh there's people that still are, are doing their passover and they're you know they're just as much of our team as everyone else here as well and so basically we, we're right around 250 or so um but we're going to keep we're going to keep this open because a lot of people are saying with jamal you know i you know the bank was closed and i couldn't get my things in i, I need until tuesday um, I'm probably flying to, to Dubai either tonight or tomorrow as well. So, um, you know, then that's going to be the call time. Um, Dr. Kraft has, has, has volunteered. So we're going to, we're going to have the, the, the group issue, the, the issuing group start to get your receipts and your invoices together, try to get all those things as smooth and as clean as possible. But yeah, but just so you know, we're going to, we're going to stay open so that people can go ahead. We only got about 50 packages left. Right, um, but we still got to finish up. A lot of people came forward and claimed some commissions as well. Um, I know you, you you came to me as well, Kim, but I was just exhausted, so I couldn't really go through all those numbers. Um, but basically, um, we're gonna go ahead and get the rest of those uh, the rest of those fifty packs out. I know they're gonna go fast because a lot of people, you know, people still getting getting uh, shares for their family members, and people still still want to get shares for their friends. I know some my people are telling me, hey, you know, I got. Two or three more friends coming in you know are we still open and the answer to that is yes right although we want to finish up as fast as we can you know i want everyone to know again such great great appreciation for you guys and you'll see everyone that's here will be part of the, the, the direction the idea of how humanity continues to unfold you know how we how we push this, this forward to benefit everyone um you know and you know you know and i just say in the spiritual kingdom of humanity Right, because this is really a, a fight good against evil, and we know that, you know, um, the banking system, everything is just going to start going further downhill from now. So, 
you know, take a quick breather, you know, thank yourself. We've crossed at the halfway mark. We got the license in hand right now. And everyone who is here is going to be part owner of that. So really bless yourself, bless your families for all the hard work you've done, you know, it's going to pay off. Right. And so um, I know somebody reached out to me yesterday. They want to get some friends in and stuff like that. So um, please go ahead. And, and if you got invoices to finish, to finish up with, finish up with those invoices, um, finish up with those invoices. And we're going to leave it open to people that want to get their families in. And because we got more money, we're going to, we're going to, uh, make another bonus available to give away for all of you guys because you know why not <laughs> you know, everyone everyone here you guys are the warriors so why not why not make that available so I'm gonna open it for Marcus I know he just he just uh fell asleep about 10 minutes ago and, and what a wonderful leader we have he just got right back up to get on this call so maybe a 15 minutes nap because he had to meet with the royal family to take care of the rest of that payment last night um and you know so congratulations again and Marcus uh if you're there and I know you're there and you're awake, you know, um, I'm gonna open the floor to you, <laughs> share what you gotta share, I'm here. and we'll we'll take it from there. Love you, brother, for all the work you do. Love the team. Go ahead, uh, appreciate you. I appreciate you. And uh, family, I appreciate everybody on the call. Look, we're we are going forward. I believe we was going forward anyway, but we're going forward in a rocket ship. Um, had a great meeting last night. We finished the rocket finished ship. everything we need to do with can you hear me? Yeah, I just I was just being goofy. I said rocket ship. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> See, you got a lot of energy. You got a lot of energy left. So all good. Look, so let's just go over the facts of where we're at now. Now we've got the things that we wanted. We have the business. We have the op we have the power to operate the business uh, through these two licenses, both here in Dubai, but anywhere else in the world. That's part of our contracted, we're under the regulatory framework to cover of Dubai, of Dubai government and it's and it's game anything that we need to do are covered in these two licenses. Um, so we finished uh, finished that today. We're gonna sign, we're actually uh, looking at office space. We're gonna have a joint office with, this hasn't been announced, but I'm telling you guys, we'll have a joint office with the Royal family. So we're looking at office space tomorrow uh, when I get up. And then on Wednesday, we're going to sign for this license. I'll make sure to send you guys some pictures. Uh, we're going to sign myself and the uh, and his is going to sign on Wednesday. And then we're then we're live. You know, it's on, they're going to file for it, and then we'll be live. So with that being said, now we have everything we need to get in the infrastructure phase. Um, super exciting. Now we can go to the very next step. And we're going to start claiming these NFTs. People in Africa, we're gonna launch our coin. Uh, the white paper is gonna come out. The white paper for the coin should be out. We I did a final review of it today. Uh, I know Jamal left us in your inbox. I don't know if you had a chance to look at it yet, but we'll put out the uh, we'll put out the white paper maybe as early as tomorrow for uh, Cyrus the coin, um, and then we then we will launch the coin, and from there we're gonna we, you know we will be rocking and we'll rolling or cooking with gas in the way you want to look at it. Um, you know, the important thing to know next, right? Yep, go ahead. It's still an opportunity to get in here and get part of this because we part of these uh, packs and you got to get them, at, you know, first come, first serve. So get them as soon as possible. But the very next thing that we talk about is now building the, de the decentralized infrastructure for the African economy and really for the global economy. And I know those sounds like big words, you know, sound like, like, wow, those are big things. Somebody's saying something big, but we're actually both in the lead. We're in front of everybody else. We have the best plan for it and we know how to get it done. So now with the support of, with the support of everybody, we have a support of, which starts with you guys, but then the support of everybody else, we should be first to market and first in, in a very big way. So really excited about that. This is a trillion dollar opportunity. The stuff that we've talked about, you know, when we talk about you can make money here, make money there, those are those are the bits. The big opportunity is coming right now, and you'll see every day uh, that unfold before your very eyes and how to participate and take take advantage of that. But you also see that because you're part of Humanity or ASL or now Humanity Payment License, you know, program, whether you're Angel or an ambassador, you'll see that you've got yourself into a to a really great position 
that's going to pay a lifelong lifetime of benefits for you. So I'm going to keep, I'm going to say really short today, um, mostly because I'm sleepy, <laughs> but I'll say really short today. I just wanted to jump on and say, you know, congratulations. We did it. Uh, we did the next step. And now and we control our own destiny. There are no, you know, super wells here to tell us what to do. We're turning this very fast over to the community. You guys are going to get to vote on a lot of stuff. And it's coming really fast. We, uh, the, the mechanism of turning over the governance of humanity and Cyrus to you guys is already in place. And so we're rolling this out, you guys being in the community. And so we're rolling this out and we're going to turn over the governance pretty fast uh, to you guys. And then we're just we're going to work, you know, obviously keep working, you know, forever to build value in the ecosystem. We're going to turn the governance over to, to the community. And this is going to be a truly decentralized community led program. So really excited about that and all other opportunities that we have. So with that, I'm going to turn it back over to Jamal, but just wanted to say thank you. And you're going to thank yourself for many years to come. Your grandkids are going to thank you, and everybody else is going to thank you as well. I know you for, for taking this, this step with us and together as a community to build this something that's going to feed literally millions and then hopefully tens of millions, hundreds of million people in Africa and the rest of the world while it built the new infrastructure, the new economic infrastructure for the world. A very, very exciting process. A project, very, very exciting time. And you're right here in the middle of it, so we appreciate you greatly. All right, with that, I want to turn it over to Jamal, and then uh, I'll talk to you tomorrow night. Roger, Dodger. Um, and we'll thank you, Marcus. Appreciate you. Um, you guys opened up until Marcus, thank you again, because you worked until about 10 minutes before this call and we fell asleep and got back at the end on the call. So you guys can open up and tell them thank you for all the hard work. So, so you know that we appreciate them. Thank you, Marcus. Thank, thank you, Marcus. Marcus. Appreciate you, yeah. job, man. Thank, thank you, Marcus. 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 you, Marcus. Thank 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 you, <laughs> yeah, we're gonna get there. All thank right. you, Marcus. I'll, I'll, I'm jumping. I'll see you Hey, family. I think take care. We're talking to. You. I'll be on the call tomorrow. Uh, Jamal, let me know about your flight when you uh, just put in my um my box. Okay, sounds good, brother. Thanks. Right. We'll get some rest. All right. Hey guys. Um, thank you again, Marcus, for everything that you do and uh, working tirelessly. If if we work a lot, their brother work more. So you know that that's a that's a sign of true leadership. All right. So, um. Again, you know, again, I just keep telling you how, how much, you know, we appreciate everyone on this line for, for all the hard work. I know a lot of you guys stayed up, but a lot of you guys are running around to get things done. And, you know, people ran to encounters with the bank challenges and everything else. So um, everything worked out so that people who are here can still get in. You know, like when you're on the flight, they tell you put your, put your mask on. All you guys got your mask on now. And there's still, there's still more left on the table. So if people that you care about, you know, now you put the children's mask on, you put the other people's mask on and help them to get a piece of license because there really is, there really is, again, you know, we said this multiple times, but the harvest is so plentiful and, you know, we want to give as many people as possible a chance to be able to be in this. And once those 50 packages are done, it, that's it, it's done. You know, um, there's, there's no more to sell. There's no more, you know, um, somebody asked me yesterday, can I keep some packages till June? They're going to get money in June. And I said, as much as I like to, by June, you know, we want to have all of our Cyrus coin issued and paid out and everything else. We need to be in like three phases later by June, <laughs> you know, because um, by the way, if, you, if you're unmuted. All right, there you go. I just solved that. All right. So, um, but as I was saying, you know, by June, we hope to be in a further phase because everyone that's invested here, you know, wants to be able to start to see, you know, some, uh, some returns kicking back as soon as possible. So um, I'm going to hop on the flight and head out to Dubai and, and uh, so we can get some of these things together. Um, all right, so hold on. I got a message coming in from uh, my boss here. <laughs> Dr. Craft, you're so funny. She says, please clarify, is the O2 mask not the pandemic mask? You are so funny. All right, good. <laughs> all right, good. So yeah, yeah. Uh, 
I, everyone has ever flown in an airplane, you know, they tell you to put your oxygen mask on and then, and then put your, um, and then put the children's or whoever else's mask on. So that's what I meant. Oxygen mask, not pandemic mask. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> that too. Good. Good. Well Thanks. said. Right. So, um, so now, you know, again, you know, you got family members, you got people, you got friends, you know, you know, let them in, um, let them in because when you understand the kind of numbers that everyone here is going to be making, it, it's just ridiculous. And as well, um, you know, with the community, you know, there's an old proverb that says that it takes a community to raise a child with, you know, this is our, this is our brainchild, so to speak, right? And so, you know, really and truly, <clears throat> um, we're going to organize it some kind of way where, where we got an ambassador and, and an angel call. So all the information that, that is going, you know, what to do next, um, there's going to be a chair committee that's going to oversee, that's going to oversee the, uh, you know, the coins. Um, the distribution of coins and Cyrus coins. And so, you know, we, we're going to call on people here just to, and we want to get your feedback. <clears throat> so let me know, you know, let me know, okay, we want to go left, we want to go right. You know, we'll, this team right here will vote on a lot of stuff. You guys will be privy to, to information uh, beforehand. You guys will be privy to information beforehand so that, that you know, we'll, we'll make decisions together as to, we'll make decisions together as to, you know, where to go, what to do, what's first, what's next. All right. And so, again, so stay tuned for that. Um, also, I wanted to let you guys know there's going to be a leadership, uh, a, a, a team leadership bonus. In other words, for all the people that took all the effort and put together, um, put together the work to make this possible. Uh, what we're going to do is if you have and to, to qualify for this, to qualify for this, here's what the qualifications are. It means you need to have three ambassadors direct to you so it means you sponsor three people that are ambassador right and that will pay you three levels of commission deep <clears throat> so in other words um if uh let's say that uh, let's say caleb you sponsored myself i'll be one so ambassador angel you sponsored uh dr craft which is another person um ambassador angel and you sponsored uh Ms. Malika. Now we don't want to encourage people just to kind of, we don't want to encourage people to, to, to family up. In other words, um, just again, there's more money than we need here. There really is. And so, you know, my perspective, and this doesn't have to be anybody else's perspective, um, but with, when you really, really see, like, I know we kind of hear it in our heads and kind of have an idea, but it's only as time keeps going, as people on this call have told me, like, as thing, things kept going, they, they start to see the bigger picture. But it, when you really see how much is available, um, there's people in your family that are, or people around you that you would have wished that were able to get a piece of it, right? Because my, my philosophy, if I rather make, instead of making 10 million, I rather make, I rather make, uh, you know, 5 million or 4 million and have, you know, the other 5 million be distributed to, you know, 50 people make 100,000 or whatever number it is, if you get what I'm coming from, right? More of, us, more of us to pay for the bill when we all, when we all go out to eat. <laughs> um, I think, Ari, you mentioned a cruise that we should do at some point in time. So at some point in time, as soon as we get, you know, some of the big stuff out the way, I think we should all find a way to get together, whether it's a cruise, whether it's Dubai, where, wherever it is, we'll find a way to fill up, all of us to get together and shake hands and meet and greet, you know, um, so I think that'd be, that'd be amazing. So again, I'm gonna be calling on, I'm gonna be calling on all the ambassadors and the angels to, to, for feedback so that, so that we can help to shape this in the way that we wanna see it being shaped. Um, all of you are part owners of the license, all of you, all of us um, have contributed. So all of us are gonna, gonna be really making the decisions about how this whole humanity project goes. So, um, you know, this is like being able to shape the idea of where Bitcoin goes because the blockchain itself is going to be distributing, you know, our coin. And so none of us has our hands in, you know, has our hands to be able to direct it. But the ideas, the, the, the way it goes and what should be added, what shouldn't be added, that's, that's all, that's all going to come from all the, all the, the warriors here, the warriors and warriesses, <laughs> that's even a word, but all the warriors here that, that help to make this happen. All right. And so um, don't panic. I know a lot of people still got, you know, some people are still on Passover. Um, <laughs> Kathy, if you don't stop messing me crazy stuff, make me laugh over here. I don't know. Uh, <laughs> she's messaging, not, not a Petri dish cruise. Okay, good. No Petri dish cruise is you know, like a cruise liner cruise. But um, 
you know, so we've got um, all of the uh, the big, big, big stuff done, but now now is you know it's the shaping of it, right? And so again, for that leadership bonus, um, which is going to pay you three levels, and you know, especially if you got leaders, and this is something that came to my attention as well. And going forward, since you guys have all proven yourself as warriors and leaders, you know, um, you know, I'll speak as such, right? Everything that, that happens in, in our project going forward, I'll be transparent with you guys, always know everything that's happening um, because this is our project, not mine, not Marcus's. Marcus is trying to turn this over as fast as possible. Um, so it's decentralized, right? And so we don't have a target on our backs because, you know, as we grow, there's people that really don't want, there's people that, I'll give you an example. I'm, I'm from originally from a little island called Barbados in the Caribbean, and I got a friend down there. He was part of the let's call it the aristocracy there. And he said, he said, Jamal, I got family that has a hundred, two, three hundred million Barbados dollars, in, well, dollars in a bank. He didn't say Barbados or U.S., but two hundred to two, three hundred million dollars, and it's only a two to one exchange rate. So even if three hundred million Barbados is one hundred fifty million U.S., he says they have no interest in seeing this thing changing. They have no interest in seeing anything changing because they got three hundred million dollars in the bank. Well, there's people that have same kinds of money in the banks all around the world that benefit from Africa and and all the other places remaining in the way that they are. And so the work we're doing is serious work because um, there's people that, 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 you know, everyone isn't like us that really wants to see humanity uplift. There's people that have benefit, benefited from for many years, um, you know, things staying the same. And, and, and those people that are not going to be in favor of what we're doing. And so Everything that we do, we want to make sure that we work on three principles. Everything that we do should, should first look at the safety of our community, um, also the stability of everything that we do, and the sustainability of everything that we do. So every project, every everything that comes to the table is going to be is going to be uh, looked at through those lenses. Is it going to be something that, that keeps the community safe? Is is it going to be something that brings more stability to our project? And is it something that's going to bring more sustainability to our project? Because we want this thing to outlast this and outlive this, right? And so we're going to keep those things in mind. So again, for the last for the for the again for the for that leadership bonus, that's going to be a ten percent override on the volume. Okay, so let me explain it to you real quick. And to, to, well, I don't know if tomorrow. I don't know if tomorrow. If maybe we'll have a call, but I won't be on the call tomorrow. If I do fly tonight, I still got to figure out how to do that. I think Mark has rubbed off on me. I used to book flights four and five days in advance, but um, I got a couple of things to wrap up here. And if I wrap them up, I'll, I'll just book a flight and hop on a flight tonight, all right? But which really speaks as well to all of you guys that um, still work a nine to five job, congratulations. Some point in time here in the future, you'll be free to choose if you want, if you like that and you want to stay doing it, or if you want to wake up one morning and go to the airport and just um, book a flight, okay? That's, that's, that's what you just did for your families right now. You'll be able to, to wake up uh, funny quick side story. I had a cousin of mine come, came came and visited me in Minnesota a couple of years back, and uh, and it was about nine o'clock. She had a flight in the morning, and so you know it was about ten o'clock. Her flight was, and so about eight o'clock in the morning, I'm taken to the airport. It was a local a, a domestic flight, so just the hour before, and I saw all these cars backed up on the road, and I was like, like, what is there? Is there an accident or what? She's like, no, it's rush hour. You you know, you know, wait, like rush? Oh, rush hour. Um, I typically don't wake up before nine o'clock in the morning, guys, right? And this is by design. So you guys all put the work in and, you know, a lot of people here are going to get their freedom from helping other people in humanity. How, how great is that? How great is that? Okay. Um, we put in this team leadership bonus in place because there's a lot of people that did a lot of work. So please, if the person that you've been working with, especially if they've been helpful to you, uh, please don't, don't, don't do stuff to not have them benefit from, from any of the bonuses um, because what goes around comes around, okay? So please make sure, um, you know, don't let, the, don't, let the, don't let the other side get into you when, when we feel like we need to, you know, do more than, than we really do need to because there's really, there's really more than anyone here as this, as this thing grows out, guys, because this license, by the way, um, we're doing Africa first, but Asia is going to be right behind us, Latin America is going to be right behind us. And those people won't be able to buy into the license that I know of, right? So it means as it continues to grow, everything else is going to continue to grow, wallets and everything else like that. So you have no idea how wealthy um, a lot of people here are going to become. 
along with how many people you're going to feed, like when you're actually able to, to log into your back office and see people that you that you actually bought these NFTs for actually doing work and us being actually able to reach out to some of them and, and give them mentorship. And when and then just imagine this, when you get on a plane and you go to some of those countries, those people, you can actually go and meet some of those people. So this is a real, real life deal. You can actually go meet some of the people that you sponsored and that you've seen their lives change and you've seen their kids go to school. And for me, that's like, that's like the pinnacle of what, what everything we're doing. Get on a flight, go eat some, some good. Uh, when I go to countries, I don't, I don't care much for hanging out in the cities. I like to go to small villages and all those, all those areas to take my shoes off and walk around barefoot. That's, that's just me. <laughs> you know what I mean, like all the, all the five-star restaurants and all that. I mean, that's okay for me, but you know, you know how much, you know, and if that's your thing, go for it. You know, that's what you made the money for, but how much more fancy can you get to steak and, and the knives and forks? Right. But I just rather go put my hands in some, in the food and eat with my hands out, you know, out in the middle of nowhere and see the people that we actually supporting. Like that's, you know, with a mosquito net, of course. Um, <laughs> I'm probably, I'm probably a little, a, you know, uh, I'm kind of in the middle, probably a little, a little wooden tent because I don't want no beers and none of that kind of stuff, you know, coming out, you know, no beers, no lions, no, no snakes. I'm, <laughs> I ain't sleeping no t- <laughs> I walk, hilarious. I walk around, I walk around barefoot, but you know, hey, you, you're gonna have to give me a little wooden tent, you know. <laughs> okay. He had been. Hey, what is the truth though, right? <laughs> yeah. Marcus only goes glamping. <laughs> <laughs> actually, Mark, uh, actually, Marcus, when you guys get to meet him in person, he really, he got that fancy kind of but he a real down to earth, you know, St. Louis born dude. Like we had a hotel here one day and he came into my room, laid on the couch and fell asleep. <laughs> he was like, Brian going back downstairs. I'm gonna sleep on the couch here in your room. Got a whole yeah. other room now. Yeah. So he he, I mean, he, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. he do he do a lot of the a lot of the stuff he do with all the fancy all the fancy stuff. It's not really for him. That's 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 really for the people that the investors just, and stuff like that that need to see that in order to uh in order to see Mark that person. He got a big old room there. And... Oh, did they hear me? Yeah, they can hear you, Miss Ola. Sorry, we love your accent though. You sound real cool. <laughs> yeah. Wow. <laughs> but no, it's true. It's true. I'm, I'm, I'm telling you, we, you know, we, um, we went to some friend's house and, and, um, Margaret was like, no, nah, I'm gonna sleep right here on the floor. <laughs> he, that kind of dude. So he can go from the penthouse to, to crashing on the floor, with everybody else. And that's, that's the truth. I've seen it in my own eyes. You know, we, we went to people's house and we both crashed on the floor. We was like, yo, let's give us a corner. <laughs> we, we was too far. We didn't want to go back to the hotel. And we was like, yo, just give us a blanket and corner, give us some cushions, throw on the floor. So we them kind of people. And that's that's the truth, right? So, um, but with that being said, though, so again, you know, make sure that the people who've been taking care of you, the leaders that brought you on, people that stayed up nights to send emails for you and talk to your people, make sure that you're not cutting them out the deal because you think that you need to sponsor somebody else just to do that. Now, if it's if it and if it is, I mean, I, I know people that generally like you know husbands and wives that generally well let me let me buy some wife wasn't interested in the beginning and now she bought some whatever it is that's fine. And some people have come to me and said, hey, Jamal, can I do this? And then this, and this because they came to me. I say, you know, thank you for your transparency. Yeah, go ahead and do it because there's more than that. But just just make sure that the people that brought you in, you know, you know, aren't being aren't being cut off, you know, because, you know, because, you know, you want to sponsor your cat because you think you're going to get extra commissions for it. Right. So that's so all self-governing. Nobody's going to come to your house and nobody's going to come and check and double check with you. But but you got to know that for yourself. And, you know, you got to live with that, right? So that's all I'm saying on that, enough on that, right? But what I'm going to do is, what I'm going to do is, for all the leaders, though, if and if you're a leader, which means that you didn't just sponsor one person and hope for them to go to work and you, and you just kind of hit out in the corner and just waited for them to do all the work for you, right? Again, we're talking real talk. This is real talk because we got real leaders and real warriors on this phone, right? So this is just straight talk, all right? Um, but it's, it's the leaders that are here, the leaders that are here, you brought on three ambassadors, and if you got two, go ahead and get one more. And that's why we leave this open as well, people to do that, because that's going to be an additional override for your team. You want to you want to reward the people who have been, you know, staying up late, taking care of people, taking care of other people as well, right? So we're going to find ways to make that happen. All right, guys. So am I leaving anything out, Doctor Kraft? Am I leaving anything out? Nope. I think you've covered everything. All right. Good. So. 
So um, I'm going to stop our recording.